Hey everyone and welcome to a new video here on my channel. Today I want to talk about the new breakthrough in the world of AI characters you can use for your games but also for virtual showrooms and 3D visualizations. Have you ever noticed how video game characters, especially the ones you don't control, have been evolving? Back in the day, talking to them felt a bit like choosing options from a menu. But guess what? Things are changing as you already saw in my previous videos. And it's all thanks to some pretty cool new tech. Conf AI makes it possible to hook up those characters with AI so they can hear what you're talking about and reply in seconds. And the possibilities here are endless. You can use them to build your AI characters for your games, but we've gone away further. We build virtual 3D offices there where you can get a tour from the employee AI characters who can explain the product or service or you can also talk with AI customer testimonials about their experiences which will build up trust and shorten the sales cycles since those AI characters are also able to recommend products and actually sell them. This all sounds cool but let's go back in time so I can show you why the new changes are so awesome. We all know those old school dialogue trees and I mean the ones where you would pick a response and the NPC would reply something pre-written. It was like having a conversation but not quite, like players often felt like they were on a set path with limited choices and not much room to really explore. And large language model powered NPCs can change this now. Because here's where it will get exciting. Due to the large language models, the characters can understand what you are saying and can come up with responses all by their own, just like a real person would do. And it's like chatting with a buddy, but they are actually part of the game and are even aware about their environment and defined objects around them in the game world. But now here's the tricky part, with NPCs being able to say anything, how can we make sure the game still feels like a well game and the responses are like what we want them to say basically. We don't want players wandering around aimlessly or feeling like they've hit a dead end or in the story or something like that. So how do we strike the balance between free flowing conversations and keeping the game moving forward? And here's where I want to introduce you to the new feature I wanted to highlight here in this video called the narrative design and it's a new feature from Conf AI. This new feature enables us to give the characters a roadmap for a conversation and instead of telling them exactly what they should say, they still get to say whatever fits in the situation, but we make sure they are always nudging the story in the right direction. And this was an example for games, but also in the business world this can be a game changer. Imagine any sales situation in which those AI characters should follow a proven script, they can do exactly that now. And instead of humans, they don't react to rejection, so their performance stays the same every day, every night, and which makes it easier to customize and fine-tune them to achieve better results. And it's like giving them a GPS for like storytelling or something like that. But how all of this works? Each part of the story has different options and the NPC picks the one that makes the most sense based on what you're doing in the game. This way every conversation feels fresh and exciting but it still ties back to the main story which will in the end also add a lot of replayability because you maybe have more paths you can go. With narrative design players get the best of both worlds. They can have those super dynamic conversations with NPCs almost like chatting with a real person but at the same time they know they are like still part of a bigger story with goals to achieve and with adventures to embark on. And here's where I really ask myself like what does future hold for video game characters? Well if narrative design has anything to say about it, it's going to be pretty damn amazing. Imagine games like The Last of Us where you have for example Ellie following you for some time. Interactions between the characters could be so much more dynamic and, and I mean you could ask her anything you want to learn more about the apocalyptic world and how it was to grow up in such a world. With technology getting better and better and NPCs are also going to feel more alive and lifelike than ever before. Every conversation will be a new adventure and players will be right at the heart of it all. 
And this is only the beginning and imagine games like GTA coming out and having those AI characters. About this topic I by the way also made another video on my channel some weeks ago so feel free to also check that out as well. But if you are looking now to get some support to set up those AI characters for your game or project, I'm looking forward to hearing from you and to learn more about your projects and use cases for those characters. We already set up those characters for different games but also for virtual 3D showrooms or offices and much more. Also our own virtual 3D office is featuring those AI characters so that you can walk around there, talk with our team and also customer testimonials. You can also find the link there in the description to directly play it in your browser without the need of downloading anything. But that's it for the video. Here you can also find my mail if you have any questions regarding those characters and how you can integrate them in your projects. I would be happy to help there. And yeah, that's it for the video. I hope you enjoyed it and please also leave a like there and consider a subscription to my channel to don't leave out any AI related updates to game development and also like the virtual 3D showrooms we are building. But yeah, have a nice rest of your day and take care everyone. Bye.